Okay, so I want to do a quick demo on how you can play two different scales together. I'm going to use my looper, my RC30 loop station looper. Um, it's a very basic um, looper made by Boss. Boss makes high quality loopers for not too expensive. And it's just, a, this one's two pedal, but you can even get a one pedal looper that can do more than what you need to create just simple melodic background with another instrument that you can play with. You can do that with other people as well, but I just want to demonstrate to you how um, different scales can play together. In this case, I'm going to do the most basic two scales that can play together, and that would be the Aeolian minor and the Native American style flute, which is the pentatonic minor. Aeolian minor is a seven note minor scale, and it sounds like this. <laughs> So um, all of the notes on the Native American style flute, the pentatonic minor, are in here as well. I'll play them really quick. Watch my fingers. It's um, to achieve the pentatonic minor, you lift the bottom two simultaneously and the top two simultaneously. And the highest note you're going to be getting with all fingers covered except the top note. That is the same with um, any penny whistles or anything like that. I've always been tuned that way. Um, transverse flutes typically are that way. I think even Cana flutes do that as well, and Arabian flutes. So many flutes are tuned to where the high note is all fingers covered, top note off. That's the high note of the of the scale, of the key that it's in. Okay. So again. And so generally speaking with Aeolian and Native American style flutes, I would prefer most times to play like a basic melody in the Native American style flute. Since it has less notes and it's actually the simpler um, of the two scales, the Aeolian and the Native, um, I would prefer to play the pentatonic minor, the Native style flute, um, as the simple melody and then have the aeolian minor flute dance over the top because it creates a little bit more flavor because you have a few half steps in there that you can dance over the top of the flute. In this case, I'm actually going to play the low B and this is one of those contra bass um, F sharp custom order. Gorgeous. Look at that abalone inlay. Yep. Dragon wings, purple heart, beautiful flute. Um, low F sharp B Aeolian. And then I'm just going to use a simple um, high B no frills to play over the top of it and we'll see how it sounds. Like I said, I'm more comfortable playing the Aeolian over the native um, bass flute or just a basic melody. It doesn't have to be a bass flute. And if you looked, I did a little maybe half hour flute concert demonstrating um, several flutes last month and I actually I think in that played an E alternating drone flute um, native Native American style looped that and then played an E Aeolian eight hole alternating drone flute played that it sounded beautiful so that's another example but here I just want to show you once again that they absolutely can be played together um, and so in purchasing flutes keep that in mind it gives yourself some diversity, but also it doesn't mean they have to be played alone. You can play with a, an Aeolian with another flute player if you get the same key that they got. So if you're ever thinking about purchasing, trying something new, something to keep in mind. Okay, I'll play a song for you. I hope you enjoy it. Subscribe to our channel if you haven't already and like our video. Thanks. <laughs>
hope you liked it.